Hi guys! Hey everyone! Welcome to Make 2 and the Sims Mobile Hot Tub event. This is the first event that the game has done since it was released worldwide. And it started March 15th, 2018 for us. It'll last for about 7 days. And we don't know if it will be repeated. We did ask and they told us no promises of it coming back. So if you guys want this stuff, then you definitely should get into your games and start working. The event starts with a 9 part quest with actions that you can take all over town. And there's also two themed workplace events that you can do throughout the whole of the limited time event to earn more of what? Ducks. What are ducks? Ducks are a new type of currency just for this event and you earn them through quest tasks and also the themed workplace events. You can then use ducks for chances to win prizes. Prizes are outdoor themed like hot tubs, swimsuits, outdoor furniture, and there's a whole bunch that you can collect. And let's see, what are the requirements in order to do the Hot Tub Dreams event? Well, first of all, you need to be at at least level 4 so that the market square is unlocked because inside the market square, you're going to need the fashion studio and the restaurant to do those themed workplace events. You're also going to need enough simoleons to buy a few things, including unlocking the fashion studio and the restaurant. So let's now get started on the quest. We're going to take you through all nine parts of this nine part quest. Part one. What a week. Wish I had a hot tub to relax in, but a nap in bed sounds good too. Okay, so this is pretty straightforward. Just have one of our sims going to their bed and dreaming about hot tubs. Yep, just if you don't see the option to dream about hot tubs, scroll down the list of options for things to do in the bed and it's that blue button as we showed. Alright, so the next task of the little quest is watch the home hot tubbing channel. And it looks like we're going to need a TV. Do you have a TV in the house? Magically have a TV. Sweet. All right. <laughs> and again, just tap on the blue button option to do the quest task. As you can see in the quest button in the bottom right, that's where we can see the task was completed. And now we get part three. Head to the fashion studio to try out the Haute Tub Couture fashion <laughs> event. All right. So this is, as we said, the fashion studio is in the market square. So you will need to have that unlocked. And here we go, unlocking it. It costs a freaking freaking load of... <laughs> it, does, it didn't cost me that much. Didn't Why it? did it cost maybe you? Maybe because I unlocked something else first. Maybe it's like Sims 3 wow. Houses. Wow! Yeah, it was like a massive day. Oh my gosh! <laughs> and now Mittens has to work for three and a half hours on this event. So it's in the fashion studio. She is not a career fashionista. This mm -hmm. does not affect her career. She still has her career. She's just... Borrowing the yeah, fashion studio exactly. to do this. Mm -hmm. Okay, so yeah, you basically just kind of do a whole bunch of themed tasks, like making a microscopic bikini at this sewing station <laughs> here. And Let's see, is she going to do it? Yay, she's done it. Sweet. <laughs> So you actually do need to have completed a risky action successfully in order to craft a swimsuit. And once you have crafted a swimsuit, you can then have this option to ask any sim to try on the swimsuit. Which is pretty cool. Yeah. You don't need to do these things in order to advance through the event. You advance just in the normal way. Yeah. So let's say that we have finished the little work-themed event. Now we have to buy and wear the dreamy swimsuit. And we have both male and female options for the swimsuit. So we currently got a female sim selected, so we'll just go ahead and use her. We'll go into her change appearance section here of create a sim, go into style and then apparel. And where is it? Oh, yeah, there it is under the stars. outfits. Yes. Mm -hmm. Nice. A uh, white one piece. Risky if you get in the water. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to purchase this and we'll have her staying in this swimsuit because why not? <laughs> I like how you have a blue sim. I have a blue sim. Mine is Bluebell. Mine's Mittens. Mittens, all right. <laughs> I copied you. Part five, check out your dreamy new swimsuit in a mirror. So we're going to pop home so Mittens can take a look at herself in the mirror. There is a mirror in the fashion studio, but I don't it know didn't, it, it didn't work. It didn't I did work? try. Okay. Yeah, yeah. All right, so at home we have a mirror, and just <laughs> like before, you use the blue button, and she does the action. Now, show off your swimsuit to friends. You're going to gonna pick somebody random? Friend. No, it has oh. to be somebody you know. So I'm going to call over Helena, Mitten's soulmate. It's got to be one of your contacts, another sim that you yes. already have a social relationship with. Mm -hmm. And again, blue button at the top. It doesn't use up energy. None of these do. Mm. Uh, of course, during the events, you have to use up energy. But for these little tasks, yep. it just happens. We've now completed that one. Part seven, complete the Spa Side Snacks culinary event. So as you said, this is why you need the restaurant, which will be unlocked very early in the game. Mm-hmm. So we're going to have another of our sims 
I think this is Fluffy. <laughs> You're so weird. <laughs> I give them little pet names, my Sims. Mm-hmm. Uh, Fluffy's going to start on this event. The actions here are very, very similar to the normal restaurant event, but yeah, but I Fluffy's think they're, just moonlighting. They're sort of themed as well, though, or no? Maybe not. I don't not. know. I couldn't see for this one. It seemed more for the fashion one. Yeah. But... The fashion one was definitely about swimsuits and whatnot, but this... Exactly. I was thinking maybe these are like outdoor foods that she's crafting. I don't know. Possibly. But she Scar- can... Discuss spa-flavored water, yeah. so maybe yeah. it's linked. I like your uh, hearts and stuff like that. Izzy's really been treating you well, huh? Mm-hmm, definitely. <laughs> okay, we finished that event, and now we finished that part of the quest. Next part, earn a tub load of ducky bucks. This requires 50 ducky bucks. Earning ducky bucks. <laughs> Earning 50 ducky bucks. I was trying to say that fast, but I can't. Don't, couldn't. don't. Let's not do okay. that. <laughs> this is pretty straightforward, but task eight out of nine in the quest uh, you can only do that at those two places in Market Square, the restaurant and the fashion studio, and those will need time to recharge, or you've got to pay sim cash to recharge them instantly. Mm-hmm. So they want you to take a little bit of time between parts of this uh, six-day, seven-day event, or you pay sim cash, obviously. Mm-hmm. The final task of the quest is to have our sim plan hot tub parties with three friends. Ooh. So here's uh, back with our soulmate, number one. That's our soulmate? Yep. (laughs) All right. Now with a co-worker from Fluffy. That went well. And finally mittens with her father. (laughs) Okay. He's also Fluffy's grandfather. A little weird though to have your dad at your hot tub party, I must say. Actually, that might be his grandfather. Grandfather, also Uh, weird. Yeah. Anyway, we've completed the quest. Okay, with the quest done, we actually still have the ability to work on those themed workplace events, like we said, so you can earn more ducks. But as we said, also, they will need time to recharge. So factor that into your whole six days and however many ducks you want to try and earn. If you want to check on how many ducks you've earned so far, just go into the info tab on the right of the screen and then into the inventory and under tickets you'll be able to see the ducks. Let's go ahead and buy some prizes with them. So the thing about the ducks is that you can buy these goodie bags on the left and inside the goodie bags you have a bunch of random prizes and once you buy a goodie bag it'll spin through all those possible prizes and give you a chance to win something inside. So with this first goodie bag we've won a bikini top maybe? I'm not even sure if it's the whole bikini. Yeah, just the bikini top. Just the top. top. Just the top. You can wear it by itself with other bottoms. Okay, so it's separate. That's Mm -hmm. nice. And we've now won swim trunks. And as you can see in the prizes, there's like 0 out of 2, 0 out of 5, 0 out of 10. That means you can get repeats. So if you only want like one chair, there's still a possibility that you're going to get another chair, you know, from the randomness. Yeah, whether you can also get two bikinis, for instance, that bikini top, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Uh, We did five bags here and we got five different things, including, super lucky, a nice hot tub. Yeah. You can also spend sim cash, over 100 sim cash, to buy a goodie bag as well. How is that different from the duck goodie bags? I think they're the same, it's just using sim cash. So now for the items you have unlocked, for all the Cass items, such as this bikini top, you just go to Cass and they're already unlocked. You don't have to spend any money. You can see they come in a bunch of colors. For items that are in the build buy section, just go to the storage section on your home lot scroll all the way to the right hand side and you'll see them there. So here we have the hot tub. We're going to place it down in our backyard. Ooh, I'm excited about this. Yeah. Let's end with a sign of mother and daughter enjoying a relaxing time in the hot tub. Blue, pink and green. Nice. All right, so hopefully you guys have enjoyed this walkthrough of the Sims Mobile hot tub event. It's the first time that we've ever done something like this for Sims Mobile, so hopefully we did okay. Please let us know in the comments what you think. And if you are new to our channel, feel free to subscribe because we've got plenty more Sims Mobile on the way. Thanks for watching.